back guys to part three in in one day that's just crazy you know you know that's crazy i have to i have to put my upload you know high through the roof so yeah <laughs> hope this gives you busy so we're gonna be in playoffs playoffs so recap recap we went 12 and 5 uh, we're going against San Inez. Um, the playoff schedule is sorry for the background sign, by the way. It is Oil Grande Eagles, San, Sunnyside Wildcats, Valley Christian Academy Lions, Atascado Greyhounds, Menachi Marauders, Pioneer Valley Panthers, Paso Robles Bearcats, San Inez Pirates, Mission Prep Royals, Clovis North. Broncos, San Luis Obispo Tigers, Singer Apache, Apaches, San Jose Knights, Frontier Titans, Hanford Bullpups, and Ridgeview Wolfpack. That's first. That's the first round playoffs coming up. Um, what else? What else? Oh yeah, these are the playoffs. Wait, these are the standings if you guys want to watch. Our rankings as well. We have tenth in power rankings, but here's our. If you guys want to see what we are. In this, we're number nineteen. In this, we're thirty-two. Defense, we are first in running yards. That's good. So running yards, and then offense, we're first in points, passing yards, and rushing yards against. So yeah, power ranks were ten. But yeah, that's the worst team was uh, Moore Bay. The best team was Clovis North. So, but let's hope we win this game. Should I get motivation? I'm not going to put motivation on. And should we just lose? We better not lose. Sorry for the background noise. My boy's just stealing the charger. Stole the charger. Oh, my boy just stole the charger. Whatever. Never mind. As three point game. It's a six point game. Intercepted. We get it. We have a chance. We get a three point game. Let's hope we win against. And we take the lead. Leonard, let's go. Paso High School takes the lead against Sanchez. And we take a seven point game with two minutes left in the third. But Sanchez strikes right back. Romis 14 yard scramble and they tie the game with 13 25 left in the fourth. Nope. Oh, yeah, they do. They tie the game. I thought they missed extra point. And intercepted. Booker. We should have just took the field goal. And they fumbled the ball. And we have a chance with four minutes left at their own 40-yard line. And we do punch it in. Griffin, touchdown with 132 left. And we have a seven-point game. Our defense, let's see if our defense can clutch up. Rushing yards. Intercepted. And we do. We end it off. What a pick. What a game. That's game it was an ugly game but we still made it they he had one pick one interception one touchdown one interception they had one pick with two picks and one touchdown that's not bad but if you want to see the stats i'm gonna scroll through them slowly so you guys can look at them i'm not gonna show them we got we had out six sacks Jeez, that was no that's not good. We only got we got no sacks, but we still won. We prevailed. 
<clears throat> we're going against Pioneer Valley, but first we're going to check out the the schedule league. So Royal Grande won against Sunny Sa Sunside, thirty three thirty. Valley Christian Academy Lions loses against Tascadero, seventeen twenty four. Menachi Marauders gets destroyed by Pioneer Valley, twenty seven forty one. Paso Robles, we win 27-20 against San Inez. Mission Prep Royals lose against Clovis North by a big margin, 10-48. San Luis Obispo loses against Singer in a bigger throwout, 3-48. Jeez. San Jose, 34-20. Frontier Titans win. Hanford Bullpups lose against Ridgeview in a blowout, too. 48-23. I'm scared of them. But we're going against... We're going against Pioneer Valley, which is I'm I'm absolutely scared. <laughs> you don't know how scared I am. We won against them, but doesn't mean we can win against them again. This team's different. You see, this team lost quite a few good game games they should have won, and we almost lost against Valley. So I don't have faith in our team anymore. And I shouldn't have as Bradley punches it in and we have a four point game and I can't give us motivation anymore because once I exit the game and Adam X sims the game so we're screwed as as it's a three point game. We seven point game, my bad. As Pioneer Valley we pick up a third, but we don't get that and Pioneer Valley's gonna miss a field goal, so we have a chance to actually get a field goal at least. And we do. It's a four-point game at halftime. On a long field goal. And we stop him. We sh run it in. Griffin takes the lead for us. It's a three-point game. Our defense has been clutching up so far with 6.42 left in the third. But not right now. Nope, they did. 46 yards. They tie the game up with 124 left. Our offense hasn't been doing anything. But there we go. Henry and our offense are starting to warm up. There's another touchdown back to back. With 11-03 left in the game. And the our defense has been clutching up. Come on, field goal. We got at least a field goal. But we don't need it. As we win 20 to 16, we're heading to the semifinals against the Tascadero. Oh no, we're gonna. We need to watch out. Hopefully, I. Can I upgrade at least a player? One player? I would love to at least upgrade one player before going into this game. At least. Nope. I want to at least upgrade one player. Come on, give me one player. At least I can upgrade nine. I there is one. There's can be some people, somebody with eight. There we go. But let's see if there's anybody else we can give. Ooh. Hold up. Defensive end. We can give it to our defensive end. Our defense can be better buffed. Let's see if how. One stop block shedding pass coverage. Who? We need some more pressure on that edge. We've got another pressure. But. This game's important, so I'm going to motivate our team. We might get to go to the finals if we win this game. Pat Tascadero is the best team in the league. Intercepted. Hasten. Field goal. We take the lead. So Lee makes a field goal, and we have the first points of the game. But Tascadero goes right down the field and scores a touchdown. Myers a one yard touchdown. They take the lead all of a sudden. And it's flipped. Four point lead with 501 left in first quarter. We get a first down and a huge first down again. And Jenkins runs it in 14 yards. And we have a lead now with the first quarter. Play. And we stop them. 
We pick up a first down on third down again, and we get a touchdown. Wagner, 101 overall. It's been killing us. And it's a 10-point game here in the second quarter. With 7.07 left. But make that a three-point game as Cole runs it in for Tascadero. So 302 left. We're trying to get points before the quarter ends. But we cannot. And Atascadero has taken the lead all of a sudden with 12 seconds left. And they get the ball back after half. So they can go up by 11. Oh, I thought they... I thought we... Got, and intercepted though. McKinley. So basically past Tascadero got the ball right back. But they don't miss a field goal. 67 yards. Why would they go for 67 yards? Hey, people would go for that. Apparently Griffin. A 91 overall. He's been upgraded a lot. I forgot about that. We have a motivation on our team. So that's going to help us. That's been helping us. Intercepted. Change. Can Tascadero has taken the lead with one play. One big swoop. And it's a four point game. We're in the third. But we get a ball right back. And we get the lead right back. With 15 minutes left in the fourth with the game. We have a three-point lead. Atascadero, though, takes the lead. With the touchdown of their own. Myers with 1034. It only took 26 seconds for them to take the lead. Intercepted! And Atascadero is going to win it. Unbelievable. No, we're not going to make it. Oh, we're going to lose. That sucks. It's because I didn't look at the stats. Oh, no. It was a Royal Grande who won Tascadero. St. Joseph lost against Clovis North. Oh, we would have lost either way. It was Clovis North against Tascadero. Oh, we're going to lose. Who's going to win it? Who won? I didn't look. I think I saw it. I know who won. I think I know who won. Tascadero won, not Clovis North. Wow. Tascadero, we lost against the eventual Super Bowl chance. Oh, man. <laughs> uh, we were so close. We were so close. Hey, I'm going to have him. Yeah, I'll have you too. I'm going to allow our middle linebacker to run free and I'll full back I don't care about them who's gonna who's gonna be in market hold up let's see who's gonna be in the market I'm gonna say reach the conference finals I'm confident if we don't make it to there we're gonna be, we're going down here <sighs> maybe I can upgrade our offense a little bit more you see I can upgrade our offense a little bit more <laughs> Who do we need, though? What would we need? Halfback or wide receiver? Halfback or wide receiver? Or a strong safe halfback or wide receiver, dude? Halfback or wide receiver? Halfback or wide receiver? We already have a halfback. So maybe wide receiver. Yeah, wide receiver. You take the wide receiver. You take him. We got a wide receiver. Let's go. Huge center. Take him as well. We can just trade the center. And we can take a fullback as well. There we go. That's our... um. Oh, we didn't give each much points. I should have said make it to conference finals because then we would have actually.
Mon nacht, io vinno a... I'm gonna get at least one. Um, go for like the twentieth one at least. Okay, not the twenty one. Then we're gonna go for the twenty eighth overall pick. We just need five thousand, which I can get. You know what? I'm gonna take the. I'm gonna take a Tascadero's pick. We can do that. So a future first round pick, and then a future second round pick will give us it. We'll take it. We need a first round pick to upgrade our team a little bit. So yeah, what should we take? What should we have? What does our team need? Who's gonna be leaving? Defensive tackle. Uh, we don't have anybody old on our team, really. Defensive tackle. It's gonna be a defensive tackle. Full back. Nobody who matters, really. Defensive tackle. Who do we need, though? I forgot. Who do we need? We need an OLB. And, uh, we need an outside linebacker. That's who we need. I can actually trade for him. Nope, nope. Draft real quick. I'm gonna draft just random people. I'm gonna take a half back. I'm gonna take a corn. No, I'm not. I'm gonna take a strong safety real quick. Ooh, I got another 70 overall. I'm going to take a corner back just in case we get another injury. I'm going to take a... I wish I can just trade them away. Wait, you know what? I'm going to trade these away. The last away, hours away. What if I trade for this kicker with all our... Yeah. We don't really need all these picks. Then probably just gonna get a third round pick, honestly. At this point, just get a third round pick. Trade. Third round pick. Futuristic third round pick. Third round pick. You can have all our picks, dude. Take all our picks, honestly. Sim to rest. There we go. I didn't need it wasting our, our cap room. Cause if we had, we would have had so much money. Take away, because I don't need that much contracts. I should cut people before the season actually starts, though. Because then once I don't, I'm going to have that cap that I don't need. 
that cap would absolutely see. Look at that cornerback. We don't need that much cornerback. I'm gonna just try to. I'm gonna try to trade them away, so I won't. Except for this guy. This guy can't be traded away. He's already retiring. Cut. I'm a, I was gonna look at that. That's much better. Much needed. Not they need that much people. Trade. We'll give you a seventh round pick for that. Look at that. We just took out a whole bunch of. We just took out. Carved out a whole bunch of stuff we needed. Gone. I'm gonna probably save up the points for for our quarterback. How much points do we need? Yeah, 51. I'm gonna save up. But hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, that was the playoff special. But yeah, hope you guys enjoy. And bless y'all. And you know what? We're gonna play one. Game. We're gonna watch one game. Cause why not? Against Templeton. So it's, it's Templeton. So let's see if we win. And we take a lead. You know, I'm going to have it on five so we can just watch it. And we have to take a four point, 13 point lead against Templeton. 14 point lead, my bad. No. We take a 21 to nothing game lead and with 109 left in the second quarter. Templeton's intercepted and we have the ball again. And we have 24 nothing. I think we're the only team we allowed with the Oh, we got it. We, we allowed a shutout. We got a shutout. We're going against Templeton again. <laughs> uh, we will see, we'll go against Templeton next video. But I just wanted to see that. Did we? Were, the, were, were we the only team? Yeah, we're the only team that allowed zero points all weekend. Looks like Sango had the most points this week. With 58. So far, it has the most points. Well, um, hope you guys enjoyed this video. God bless y'all, and I'll see you next time. Peace.